Hello and welcome to the fifth update of the Kinetic Brain, somewhat overdue. Uh, well, I'm delighted to say that the tracks are all complete, they're finished uh, and the only welding needed to finish it off is that final shrouding to go all the way over to give it its final shape. Um, in the last video I was incorrect with the order of things. Uh, the first uh, setting is a healthy brain, the second one is uh, stroke, the third one is dementia, the fourth one is epilepsy and the fifth one is meditation. Let's switch it on. So this first preset is a uh, healthy brain. All I'm trying to show really is that the, uh, the balls, they are, they are running such a way that they're occupying both hemispheres equally and showing continual neural activity, I guess, throughout the brain. So after I've completed the final shroud, I'd then like to turn my attention to the uh, electronics and the lighting. Now, uh, my vision is for a light to be triggered along sections of each track. I guess the reason for this is to, I don't know, maybe uh, show the, the different types of movement in each preset. Um, I don't really want to start programming Arduinos and things like that. I'd like to keep it in the mechanical domain um, so the ball will trigger something as it passes by. I think that's more in the spirit of things. I think as well as the incremental lighting, it'd be really cool to have uh, sort of uh, zone lighting throughout the sculpture. And that can, um, I don't know, highlight problem areas. Perhaps it could change colour. Uh, two amygdalas in there, maybe uh, they could change colour too, depending on the state of the brain at the time. Um, what else would be quite cool would be to have um, lighted presets and all this covered in, so it'd be like a you know like a ship's telegraph. You may recall from an earlier video that the central slice of this main frame has got some really nice uh, shapes of uh, the internal parts of the brain which has been completely lost by the addition of all this track. Um, my intention is to, uh, to pull those shapes back out again by infilling them with uh, some sort of acrylic and maybe I know, more additional lighting I guess. <laughs> 